Hey everyone, it's doing a bit of work on the 74 today. Um, I've got these spring plates I'll show you, from Superior Engineering. And what they do is they give you a lot more clearance under your springs. So if you see that plate there, I've already put the driver's side on. Everything's pretty nice and, and flush under there. And if you look at your... Um, Here's the one we haven't done yet, this is the factory Toyota one. Uh, you know, there's a bit more to jag up, get hooked on and, uh, you know, it gives you a little bit more clearance and, and, and smoother as well, you know, like, we measured the other side and it was uh, two centimeters clearance and, uh, you know, that gives you a little bit of extra shock travel and it just smooths things up underneath so you're not getting jagged as much. But anyway, we'll chuck this one on and see how we go but this is the plate here so it's basically a new spring plate and it's going to sit up and hug the the spring pack and give you you know maybe an extra inch clearance there so I was just going to measure it before and after and just see where we end up you know it's only two U bolts so you don't really need a, a how to install video but let's just take a measurement here and see how much extra clearance we're going to gain so I've got that at just under 24 centimeters. So let's put the plate on and see where we're at. So that was the most painful thing I've done in a while. I'll be cutting the other ones off and not undoing that again. That was dreadful. So anyway, see spring plate. Let's see if it'll slip on. Come on, you monkey. Ugh. Anyway. So that's roughly on. What I'm just going to do the spring, the U-bolts are universal, so I'm just going to chuck them in, just get a rough idea of it. Uh, oh, good on you. Just how long they need to be, because obviously being universal they fit many things, so I'm just going to give that a mark. Give that a mark and then I'll add enough room for the nut as well and then I'll trim those up and see how we go back in a sec cut them took about seven seven or eight centimeters off so we'll just fit those in and uh, tighten it all up Okay, it's all in. We just I just ground the um the spring pack, the the bolt that holds the spring pack together. That was sticking out a little bit, so I've ground that flat. So as you can see, it's a nice smooth surface now, so you're going to you know slide over rocks and whatnot. You know, you won't get hung up as easy. And it's given me that's 26 centimeters, so it was 24 before we started. Um, you know, just over 26 from my eyes anyway. Uh, so, you know, that, that's very close to an inch uh, clearance there. And all we've done is replace those spring plates. You know, so to get that kind of clearance, you, you know, if you went from, these are 33, so if you went to a 35, you'd be getting similar kind of clearance underneath. I'll get going on that other side, but I'll certainly be cutting those U-bolts off. I'm not doing that again.
Okay, so this side was a really good result. It came in at uh, 27 centimeters, so that's two and a half uh, centimeters gain. So um, from, from my angle, anyway. But uh, yeah, that's a good full inch. So you know, you're not going to get that unless you go put 35s on it. So I'm happy with that. Look at the, uh, you know, it's so smooth underneath. Yeah, the other side, the shock's hanging down a little bit. I think that might just settle. But, yeah, really happy with that. That was a lot easier on this side. I think if your car's a bit older, you should just grind those U-bolts off much quicker. But let's just have a little look from the back. It's a whole lot smoother underneath. Less things get jagged on, better in the ruts, in the mud. You know, it's not like a couple of anchors hanging down there, so... Anyway, hopefully that sort of gives you an idea of how they look fitted. You know, if you're uh, clever enough, you could probably fab plates like that up, but they were 200 bucks here in Oz, so, you know, not too bad. Bit of extra clearance. Fun little project during lockdown. But anyway, have a look at her. What a cracker. Anyway, thanks for watching. See ya.